Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about Davidson Figueredo versus Cody Garbrandt. UFC 300. Can't wait. Davidson Figueredo, 22 and 22, 3 and 1. He's 2 2 and 1 in his last five fights. Did move down a weight class, or moved up a weight class, sorry, to, to 135. Thought Rob Font. A lot of people thought Rob Font was going to do a lot of good things in that matchup. I did not. I thought the speed, the power, and the speed really was what the difference was in that matchup. Uh, 36 years old, which is a little worrisome, but it's Davis and Figueredo. We haven't really seen a bad, bad performance from him. Again, he has lost three times. Two of them are to Brandon Moreno. I mean, it is what it is, to be honest. Minus 300 favorite 5'5 five five with a 68-inch reach. Fighting Cody Garbrandt, 14 and 5, 3 and 2 in his last five fights, has not been the same fighter since losing to TJ Dillashaw. I don't care that he's won two in a row against Trevin Jones, who did nothing, and Brian Kelleher, who I did think could give him some problems because he is pretty well rounded, has shown a pretty decent chin in the UFC. He's only been finished by John uh, John Lineker. I thought I said that. Anyways, um, ended up finishing him. Big right hand. Brian Kelleher did not come out and fight the way I thought he was going to. It is what it is. He's a plus 240 underdog for Cody Garbrandt. The one thing that I do like about Cody in this matchup is, again, his speed. The thing I don't like about him in this matchup is that bat, that boxing style that he has still hasn't really changed him. You can say whatever you want. Again, he is fast for sure. But you say strike to strike. I'm going to take Davis and Figueredo. Every single day. Do I think Cody has the power if he hurts Figueroa to finish him? Yeah, probably. But going you go, I go, or striking at the same time, I'm going to pick Davis and Figueroa every single time. 32 years old, 5'8", with a 65 and a half inch reach, 2 and a half inch reach advantage for Davis and Figueroa. Again, I like Davison a lot in this matchup. I just think that speed and that power and fighting at a lower weight class is going to help him a lot. He's going to be the stronger fighter. But as always, like, comment, subscribe, share, all those good things. The support has been incredible. I just had my best month on YouTube. You guys are incredible. Thank you so much. Let's keep going. 2000 coming up soon, hopefully. As always, subscribe, like, comment. See you in the next one. Peace.